Hey everyone, how's it going today? Hope you guys are having an awesome day. We're back here today. We are going to be working on biological science and hopefully finishing it off. I'm not sure that it will 100% happen, but you know, we can give it our best shot, that's for sure. So let me just check this. Okay, cool. So what we need to do right now is we need to be, all right, so we've got this working on biosludge, which is good. Because really, we, we just need to fill up the bio sludge. And that's going to be working for a long time because it's going to be working to fill up this ginormous freaking tank. Um, and actually, you know what I was thinking is... Hmm. So we've got all this bio sludge here. And we're going to be using that to make sure that... Um, that the other bio sludge doesn't over, overflow. But I have a funny feeling that um, it's going to, that we need to like get rid of all of this for now. Like this is not gonna fill up for the longest of times, right? So like we don't have to really worry about it too much, but I do wanna get all of this out of here so I don't have to like worry about it. And this is such a large tank that this is just gonna be working for forever trying to, to uh, fill it up. So I might as well just, you know, use up all the bio sludge that's here. And in fact, let's just make the train come drop off all that it has. That way we can get it all in and then uh, call it good. Um, yeah. Anyways, on to next things, next steps, which next steps look like um, we are going to be working on the actual data cards now because we have everything else that we need. And let me just check on this. Whoa, what the frig? How is that even possible? Um, there's a random biter in the middle of my base. All right, I'll be right back. Alrighty, everyone, we are back here. Finally, I had actually like a couple different biter attacks from different places. I don't know exactly what was going on, but somehow biters got through all my defenses, which is fine, made sure that everything looked good. And we are back here to work on more biological science. Now, um, what I was saying before is that our next step is to actually do the different cards. So we're gonna have biochemical data, we're gonna have biomechanical, biocombustion, and I think that that is it, these first four cards for our first catalog, okay? Um, so to do that, let's see. First one is gonna be one biochem facility, which will be quite easy. We'll just put it right here, I guess. And let's also fill this guy. This is gonna be biochemical data. Uh, so we need biomass, spice, blank data cards, and chemical gel. Now, uh, let's move it back a little bit. Um, so we've got the biomass here already, which is nice. Uh, so let's see, we can come right here. Okay. Now we're gonna need to get the dirty water and stuff down here, right? So let's see. I think we can do that right here. And then we need to get the... Yeah, this is... <laughs> this is gonna be a bit annoying, I think, but it'll be fine. I guess we'll bring it down like over here. And let's see, which one's which? This one's the, this one's this one. Uh, so if we do this, 15 right here, just like that. And then this one, we can go 15 and maybe a seven. Yeah, nice. Okay, perfect. All right, so that's gonna be that. And we'll just be able to run those down this direction uh, to continue with other bad outputs, or not bad, but dirty outputs. Um, so that is one building done. Now we also are gonna need spice, blank data cards, and chemical gel. Now the chemical gel we do have down here. Uh, I didn't realize for some reason that I was gonna have to be using it for other things. I guess there's one, two other things, three other things I'm actually gonna be need needing it for because I'm gonna need to make plasma stream, which I didn't realize, which means I need to request some lithium for this actually. So hold up. We don't have any lithium. I'll be able to grab some from an, like one of the other builds to start us off, but uh, let's see. 
needed 1500. No, 150 of it, I think, is what it was. Yeah, 150. Because 10 times that is the amount I do. Uh, I guess we can bring it down. Yikes, I really made a mess, haven't I? <laughs> uh, let's see. Is there an easy way to get it, like, into here? Like, if I go through here, I might be able to fit it coming out this direction? I don't know. Like... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, throw those in there. I need to somehow get it through here. Which is not going to be easy. Uh, I guess we can do this, right? Oh wait, we can't do that. Because it, it'll, it would connect. So we do need to do this. Um, I think this. And this. Holy moly. This is insanity. Uh, although part of it is my own fault for doing things the way I did them. Uh, so it is what it is, can't complain. Uh, hold up, why do I have spice on this belt here? This should not be spice, this should be glass. I don't know how that happened, but it did. So let's pick up all that spice. There we go. Throw it back in there go. That is exactly what we need to do. Okay, then to fix this up, go here. Oh my god. <laughs> Gonna have to do this as well. Okay, there we go. That is finally going to be chemical gel here. And then we can use this 15 pipe here. Uh, and then we'll go 9... Seven, five, doesn't quite fit, so three, and then we'll finish it off just like that. There we go. Okay, getting rid of that once more. That should be chemical gel. Now we're gonna have to get um, blank data cards down here. And of course, I've once again strapped myself on space for that, which I didn't think I was going to, and yet somehow I always manage to run out of space because I am notoriously bad at planning. So, how are we going to get this through here, hmm? We're gonna go like this. We're gonna go underground right here. Like this, blank data cards. Nice, okay, we've got stuff going. <laughs> we've got things going on here. Uh, we have a ton of biocultures that I don't need. We're just gonna throw them all in here and in here. There we go. Okay. Then up here, what we can do is like this. We can have a split off for the blank data cards. Now, why is this chemical gel not hooked up? Ah, I missed a pipe, there we go. And I think we just need spice then. Now, is this actually supposed to be spice? Yes, it is, okay. <laughs> so this is actually supposed to be spice. I thought I set this filter, but I guess I didn't. Okay, I'm gonna copy that filter. And we're gonna go just like this, like this, and like this. I think that's like one of the only things that needs spice, really. We need bio, we need spice here and here, but I think nowhere else. We need the extract for the actual science. So that's all good. Now we're just gonna be waiting on the output over here, and. Near. Actually, we can do, we can downgrade those. They don't need to be fully upgraded, right? Yeah. Okay, I think that that's everything. And I must have missed one other pipe. I did miss one other pipe. Um, what am I doing here? Okay, there we go. That's all of that. That, that should fix.
fix that up. I don't need all this stuff or this. Okay. Just got lots of crap in my inventory right now from all sorts of things. All right. Um, all right. So that's card number one and number two, actually, because we've got uh, this is the genetic data is one of the first cards. We've got the biochem. Now we need to do the biomechanical. Now this is going to take lube, biomass, and blank data cards, but that's not so bad actually. So we've got our first two of these, and we'll put them back right over here, I think. Uh, let's see, let's see what the output of these looks like first. Hmm. So we could actually do like this, right? Go one, two, three. Uh, wait. Let's move this just like this, right? Right there. One, two, and then this can go like this, and this can go like that. There we go. And then we'll put the other one right, oh wait, what did I do? This needs to be like this, there we go. Okay, then if we put the other one right here, Will we be able to like hook this up nicely or no? No, I don't think so. So we're just gonna copy, or how are we gonna do this? Yeah, you know what, I, we'll, we'll, we'll make it work. Right, so then, that'll go like that, and then this, <laughs> It's a little messy, but it'll work. We'll go like that. There we go. And then we just need to get the biomass right down here. All right, just biomass and blank data cards, right? So that'll be easy. We'll split the we'll split the belt. Uh, let's see. We'll do it like this. One underground here. One underground here. And then we'll go splitter like this. Biomass on one side, and we'll go blank data cards on the other. Easy peasy. And then we'll just have two inserters. And this is all already sped up, which is cool. We just need to do boom, boom, like that. Uh, let's put as much stuff in there as we can. Um, I don't need to do that. I just want to do that. And then we are going to have to hook up lube somehow. Um, so... Our barrels of lube are over here, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to like get them over there somehow. And I'm not going to deal with um, putting them in, in a separate warehouse. So we're just gonna go out maybe to here and then come over and just have to live with the consequences as I somehow always do. All right, let's not take up the lane there for that. Um, Come right over here, put this down right here, I guess. Put this with an active provider and we'll be unbarreling lubricant. And I somehow misclicked with the autosave thing that happened. Okay, and then yikes. <laughs> what the frig am I doing here? Okay. It's gonna have to go like this. Okay, so then we just have to bring these back here. And it's super awkward, but it works. So, it'll be fine. All right, then we also need to bring this down over here. And we need to have this catch up as well. Um, I think then what I'm gonna do with these last two cards is have them get split between here, right? So this one's gonna go like on one side of the belt and then we'll have um, for the last one, which is after biomechanical, which is the thermo, ah, dude. This, this also takes um, plasma stream, right? <laughs> which is annoying. So 
Do I have, I have another thermodynamics facility, which we can put, hmm. I guess we'll put it like right over here. Yeah. And this is gonna do, not that. Where's plasma stream, hello? Am I, am I looking at the wrong thing? Oh, I am looking, what am I doing? <laughs> I need to make, um, do I not have any of these guys? Let me just see. I'm going to put one down and see if the bots build it. They, they could. Okay. That is what I need to do. And then th that's going to go into here, which is going to do the biocombustion data, which again is biomass and, um, blank data cards, which is very nice because that is quite easy. And let's see. How are we gonna do this? I just need one belt getting in here, right? Again? Just like this. And then just like this. Boom. All right, that's not so bad actually. Um, then we, so we have everything and hey, look at that. We were able to build one of these. Now we do need to get chemical gel over here, which why is it? Why do I have to make everything so difficult on myself, huh? Okay, we're gonna do this. It's gonna look silly, but we're gonna do it anyways. And then we'll go just right like this and be able to bring it down further just like that and we're going to go into satellite mode once more so we can quickly do this part as well and i think we can just finish off with some straight pipes it doesn't matter okay last but not least we are going to do a little set of pipes over there and we do need to get plasma over here or what lithium sorry lithium we need to get lithium over here so we can do it just like this we'll bring lithium down right here and we can put lithium into this warehouse here i think so go lithium and we're, i'm going to go grab some here momentarily i'm also going to go grab some more belts and things um okay we need to go across There we go. Okay, can everything get built here? No, we need to extend this slightly further. Or maybe not, I guess, I don't know. Um, okay, and then we'll go just like this. That's gonna be lithium, that'll be plasma. And then we just need to put out the plasma cards, right? So this is every, ooh, and we get junk data cards. Do we need one or two of these buildings actually? Let me hold up, let me check. Just need one think. And if we speed this up, yeah, we only need one of these as well. Where is this reach to? Okay, it doesn't reach these two buildings, unfortunately. But we can put this like right over here. That way it'll reach those two and more buildings that we put down over here. I think that that is everything. Um, th this card now, well, let's, let's go grab uh, really quickly. We're going to grab some belts and we're going to grab some lithium or yeah lithium so that we can just like kind of jump start this over here working on things right um so let's do that really quickly okay so we're going to grab undergrounds we're going to grab a handful more loaders and i'm going to request i don't even know where the lithium is stored so we're just going to request like 50 lithium. Nice, we have a lot of lithium up here. Cool. Um, okay. I think we can deal with this now. Um, one thing we are going to have to deal with are junk data cards, which are actually kind of annoying because it's so far away from it. everywhere else that junk data cards are done or dumped, right? So this belt here is junk data cards, and there's like literally no way to get junk data cards through there. Um, which means that we're just gonna have to like, I guess, wrap down over here. 
Actually, let me request some belt. What, what am I doing? Dude, I could have just literally requested all of that stuff. I always forget that. Okay. Let's, I guess, come right through here. And we'll have junk data cards, I guess, come right down here. We will throw uh, lithium in here, and we also need to filter this just in case. Lithium. There we go. And then this will be for junk data cards that are coming out of here. And what we can do is we can actually use a loader here, I think. And then we'll do a splitter. Oh wait, no, we won't do a splitter. We'll do this splitter here. Output priority. What am I doing? Okay, let's just pick up all the crap. <laughs> all right, there we go. That's junk date cards. And ooh, we need to hook up some bad. Dude, how did I screw this up? What did I do? Where did this get hooked up to? Ah, that's where it got hooked up. Okay, let's get rid of that, I guess. Uh, now the real question is, is are these things still working down here? They should be. They are not, why are they not? So this is hooked up correctly. This is hooked up incorrectly. Oh my God, what a freaking mess, dude. This is hooked up to the bio sludge, not the contaminated cosmic water. Okay, fine. This, this just is hooked up incorrectly. This needs to be hooked up here, not where it was. Right? No, wait, this is hooked up. Oh my God. What is going on here? That's hooked up correctly. This is hooked up dirty cosmic water, dirty bio sludge. Oh, they're connect. Are they connected right here? Oh my God, they are. Ha, huh. that was what the issue was. I was like, I swear I hooked this up correctly. Okay, this needs to get rid of that. This is all good. This is all good. This was hooked up, in fact, to the correct place. I just, it didn't appear like it was. Okay, get rid of that. There we go, okay. Oh, once again, no wait, that's hooked up correctly, yeah, yeah. Okay, oh my god. Such a mess, dude. And actually, you know what? I, I'm trying to feel, I, I feel like there could be an issue eventually with this and this, like working the way that they are, but we will see how that turns out. Like, I feel like this thing could just like keep making too much bio sludge, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. I think everything is actually working now. We just need to hook up the contaminated bio sludge here. Oh, frick. Uh, let's just, let's do a long pipe. Okay, there we go. Bots will come and handle all of that. And then what we can do is we can bring this down over here. And we can go right here. There we go. Okay, so now those are combined together. We can put one of these on the near side. Why is this not working anymore? It's not working anymore because, again, I screwed this up. Jeez. I really have, like, totally messed this up, haven't I? But I think I got it now. The, the, the systems seem to be actually separate, which is good, which is what we expect. Okay. Jeez Louise, dude. What a mess. All right. So we've got one, two cards here. Okay, then we've got the other two cards down here that I still do need to combine. Actually, you know what? We may be able to combine them here.
Do I want to combine them there? Not really, but maybe I should. Uh, let's move that all the way up there, actually, and then we'll go like this. Go like this. Go like this. And then like this, and then they're like kind of combined, right? It's a mess, but it works. And then we'll go right like this. There we go. And that way we still have like a splitter here for these cards, right? When we actually are gonna need them. Um, hope that makes sense that we still are gonna need these biological cards because we need them for, actually, it actually works out great because we already need them together for experimental genetic data. And I totally planned that and it was completely intentional that it works out perfectly the way that it is. So here we've got um, all of our cards. Now we're gonna like loop them back down here. That way we leave like this room open for all the second set of cards. As messy as this is gonna be, we shall survive. And then we'll go just like this. And let's leave a little bit of room between these belts just for posterity's sake because Lord knows we're gonna need room. All right, and we've got all of our biological science working now. We've got all of our buildings sped up. Yeah, so this one's sped up by this little guy, and then the rest are sped up by the big ones. Cool. Um, I think that's everything. So we actually just need to grab um, some supercomputers and some research servers so that we can start making the science. And um, I will be right back after grabbing those buildings. Alrighty guys, so we're back here and I have the buildings that we need. I've got the research servers, supercomputers, and um, what we need to do first off is we do need to get some thermal fluid over here. We need to get some super cool thermal fluid it looks like. So <clears throat> what we're going to do is head down here, we're going to grab this guy, and just uh, let's see. Hmm. <laughs> Do I want to put it down over here? Yeah, I think I do, actually. We're gonna put it over here because um, this is, it, the buildings are gonna be over this way for that. And then let's also put down, hmm. Oh, we also do need some cold thermal fluid. What do we need cold thermal fluid for? Hold up. The super cool thermal fluid is for what exactly? Oh, this. That's gonna be later on, so it doesn't matter actually. We do need the cold thermal fluid right now, so let's do that as well. Uh, let's not put that one down. Let's put this one down. Cold thermal fluid. Put that down there. Cool. And looks like train is on its way. Very nice. And then what we can do is we can, we're missing some signals here, but I think that's probably okay. We'll see if we run into any issues with it. <clears throat> Should be okay. The trains aren't gonna come very often, so I don't think it'll matter that much. And then this guy should go to a uh, priority. Wait, wait. Hold up. Isn't there, isn't there a priority pickup for cold thermal fluid? Oh, it's cool thermal fluid, got it, okay. And I've now stranded that, that train, whoops. Let's go fix that really quickly. <laughs> whoops. Okay, we can just back it up here. Get out, whoa there. And send it on its merry way back to pickup. Very cool. Okay, now in terms of getting this set up, we do need to do first, uh, I think we need two research servers. Yeah, we need two research servers doing the catalog ones. So how are we gonna do this? I always, like this part is like always the part I hate doing is the catalogs and stuff. 
Okay, so catalogs here. Can't do it like that, unfortunately, because these buildings are so dang small. But we can do it like this. Don't know how I ended up with one underground pipe in my inventory, but that's fine. And then we can go warm thermal fluid across. We are going to have to have a pickup for warm thermal fluid, which we can do like this. And it fits right there quite nicely, actually. Which means that we're going to have to like, well, we could we could do um, some other stops. We're going to need to do stops for dropping off uh, significant data. We're going to have to do stops. For, well, let's just do that, right? We're going to need a stop for significant data to be dropped off. So let's just, let's see, where can we do that? It's going to be a bit of a pain to do it here, but I think that's fine. We'll just run it over down this way and it will survive. Next, we need a stop for picking up insight, which we can just run, I guess, all the way down here. It doesn't matter really. Uh, I actually don't like this. Ah, whatever. It doesn't matter that much, really, right? Uh, this train... Is, oh, this is not this pickup. This is... Um, biological Insight pickup. Need to make sure we switch that. This should, in theory, have a train come and... Yep. All right, so it's going to come drop off... Um, significant data, which will be good. We have lots and lots and lots of significant data right now, and we'll just do that. That'll work out quite nicely for getting, there we go. There's a train full of significant data. And bots will finish off all of that. Okay, so coming back over, oh, hmm. This is a little bit unfortunate. Okay, so we're gonna have to do underground pipe that barely fits. Gonna need pipes here, pipes here, and then we need some long ones, which we can do like right here, I think. I think that's fine. And then we'll go like this, I guess, for these. It's a little long for that. Uh, we do need to actually do this. Uh, and I guess we need to do this as well. Question is, is, is that going to line up improperly? I don't know. Okay. I don't, I don't think that'll line up improperly, but we'll see, I suppose. Okay. Then this is going to come right over here. Which one is which? This one is cold. Oh, it does line up improperly anyways. That's fine. This can go right here. There we go. Okay. So cold is right here. This is cold. Is that like the perfect length? It is the perfect length, nice. Okay, and then we're gonna have to do the warm thermal fluid out, obviously, which is this one. And this we can handle like this, I guess. So that way, that way there's no, uh, that way there's plenty of room over here for this. And then, uh, I guess we'll have one belt. Dude, how are we gonna do this? <laughs> oh, we can do it like this actually, can't we? No? Oh my God. I think we need to move these one more apart. Um, and that way we can go like this and have a belt that goes out with catalogs there. And then these we'll bring in right over here to do the catalogs. And we should still have plenty of room for other belts in here if needed. 
There we go. Grab, grab, and then grab and grab. And I think that that is good enough for um, biological catalogs. Sick. That's awesome. All right, so we've got biological catalogs. Now we need to do supercomputers for insight, which right now, this is just going to be specifically for doing the actual science. Um, and the other thing about this is this right now needs cold thermal fluid, but it's going to need super cool thermal fluid when we switch the recipe. So we're just going to do them. We're just going to do one building right here right now. And then we'll, uh, we'll do another building later doing this. But right now I really just need, all I need is for this to like, just make me some insight so I can get to the next recipe, which I really, which really is all that I care about. Right. Um, and again, when we get to the next recipe, this um, will not return blank data cards. So we don't actually even need to deal with this right now. We'll just grab it manually and make the first 20 science packs by hand. And then from there, we'll actually do the real setup. So this one needs um, extract, significant data, catalog, and insight. Um, what we're going to do is, oh, and what, what does this need? Just cold? Yeah. So we're literally just, I'm, like I said, I'm just going to do a temp setup right now for this, like so, like that. And I'm literally just going to grab everything by hand. I can get rid of all of those that I had in my inventory that I don't need. And then we've got our extract right here. 30,000 of it. Jeez Louise, dude. That is quite a lot. And we can do this. We just need some significant data, which I can go grab a bunch of. Significant data. Dude, it's so nice having a lot of significant data. I don't have to worry about it. Um, we have a bunch of blank data cards or junk data cards here that I need to get rid of. Just go like this. There we go. <clears throat> and now we're going to make 20 of these science packs and check it out at 172 hours in, we have finally made our first science packs, 16, 18, 20 science packs. And that's all I'm going to do for right now. So I'm going to pick this up, pick this up pick all this stuff up and then we'll come back and we will deal with that. We're going to research this and this, and that will give us the recipe that we need to actually do the real um, bit of science. Let's also get rid of all these and all these. And then we'll come over here and I'm just going to plop down these 24 packs into here and we should fly through these two researches, which is really all I'm looking to do at the moment. There's one. And the other one is basically there now. And then we can actually do the real setup of this up here. Okay. So let's pick this up, picked up, pick up all these pipes. Cool. All right. Uh, now, for the real setup, what we're going to do is we're going to switch. Oops, what? Up. How do you. How do I change the recipe? Left click to open subfloor, right click to copy, paste, toggle. Dude, how do I switch that? I think I have to do this now. Insight, do this. Then I have to move this all the way back up, which is a real pain in the butt. I wish there was just a way to switch the recipe, which maybe there is and I just don't know about it, but um, this, wait, did I move it up too far? Yeah. There we go, okay. And then we'll do this, we'll do this. Okay, we literally only need one supercomputer doing it if it's sped up. 
uh, which is cool. Now we are gonna have to have another set of these, right? Um, and I think it's, is it super cooled now? I think it is, yeah, it's super cooled. That's what I thought. That's why I wanted to like kind of do that first. So let's see, we've got supercomputer here doing this. Um, we'll have this come right here, I guess. Actually, no, let's move it slightly. That way we'll have the other one come in there. Get rid of all those. Now we're gonna need the super cooled thermal fluid. Oops, coming up here. Let's rotate this so that it's nice. <clears throat> Let's put that there. Uh, then we're gonna, hello, I'm gonna go like this. Okay, there we go. That's that. Then we can get the warm thermal fluid out over here. Okay, warm thermal fluid out. Um, we'll go down here for this long-handed inserter going in. And then over here, we'll have a fast inserter going in there uh, like that. And I think that that is all we need to do for that. Nice. So that's gonna be for Insight. Um, we probably will need a little bit more, but I think that still one computer doing this will be perfectly fine um, based on how fast it's supposed to go. Now, what are we missing from here? We are missing... Ah, we're out of biomass. Interesting. Hmm. Why are we out of biomass? No biocultures. No biocultures because no nutrient vats. No nutrient vats because no glass. No glass because there's just not enough. Okay, we're going to request. Oh, I think this is supposed to be 5,000 glass. Maybe? No, it's supposed to be 500. I feel like there should be more. Let's do 100. And a thousand, I don't know. Maybe I stole the glass or something. Could have been. Okay, cool. And we've got 151,000 bio sludge, nice. I don't think we'll be running out of that anytime soon. The only concern I have is that the things that output bio sludge like this are gonna get uh, like overrun. So maybe what I need to do is I need to put a pump here that's hooked up to this that says that bio sludge is less than 100,000. I don't know. That way, like this thing always has room to output its bio sludge and we don't then use up all of our biomass making bio sludge. I think that that's fine. And bio sludge goes in here Mm, the only the only issue is that like bio sludge then this has to make well what's the only what what uses bio sludge over here this uses bio sludge and this uses bio sludge and then the other thing that uses bio sludge is this which this uses a decent amount hmm we'll just have to monitor this and see what happens I really don't want to run out of bio sludge but I also want to be like smart about how we use it. So the last thing we have to do is we need to set up um, a research server for doing this. We also need to extend our network so that the bots can build this stuff. So um, for doing, we got insight here, right? Yeah, this just outputs insight. So we'll do that. Insight coming out here. We will split it. Half is gonna go down yonder here. Uh, not sure how we're gonna do this. I don't know. That like kind of works. Sure. All right, <laughs> that worked out quite nicely actually. And then um, the other half will go over to research. I also want to copy paste this guy. 
Uh, let's do the whole station. Why am I not doing the whole station? I don't know. So this is going to be for uh, the actual science packs. And I think we'll move it all the way down here, possibly. Rail signal's in the way. What? Okay, there we go. And we're going to switch this name really quickly to be biological science pickup. Okay, cool. Then we need to switch these outputs to be green, double green, and then we'll deal with those later. And then we also need to hook this up here, here, wait, no, here, 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 there we go. So now this should be turned on, I think. Enable, disable, yeah, I think that's correct. Bot should come and build the rails here shortly. And then we need to get a research server set up down here for doing science. This is gonna be uh, science ones. We'll bring this all the way up here. This is gonna be, uh, let's do it over here. You know what, actually, I think I can just copy like this setup, maybe. I don't know. There we go. What is this? This is irrelevant. And then this will come right like that. Get joined together. There we go. And then the other one is going to be like this for these guys, right? Boom, just like that. That is gonna be that. This is gonna be this, and then we'll have to switch that one later, which means that these guys are gonna be for um, extract here. So this is gonna be like, extract is gonna come right like this. And we can export it right here. We'll switch the filter to be Extract, dude, this is so complicated. Like there's so many like weird byproducts and things like that with biological science, which is again, why I always do this last. <laughs> Cause it just like hurts my brain thinking about it. Okay, that looks good. And we've got all this room to do like one, two, three, four other um, cards, which is not a huge deal. Oh, we do need to, actually, what am I doing? We do need to hook this stuff up. Uh, we also need to hook this up. Hmm. Where is cold? Cold is over here, huh? Okay, let's do this, I guess. Boom, boom. That's cold. And then warm can come right down here like this and get hooked up. Okay, <laughs> that's all the fluids that needed to be hooked up, I think. Now I do need to deal with this guy doing uh, junk data cards. Junk data cards is on this belt here. So I think I can just go like, uh, no, I need to at least do, cause we're gonna, let's say we'll have, um, let's say we have another belt coming in here. I need to at least do this, right? There we go. And then this can come right down here. I wish these belts, reached a little bit longer than they do, but it's fine. And that'll join in there. Okay, great. And then this output here, uh, 
we'll have to deal with as well, because this is gonna have junk data cards on it as well as science. So it also, so yeah, science is, I guess, down here. What am I doing? I'm just clicking buttons. Science is down here. So I guess we'll do like this. We'll do output priority here for junk data cards. All the science will go there. Junk data cards will continue down here. Uh, this is a mess. Um, let's see, can I get in here easily? Like right here, maybe? Not easily, but I can get in there. <laughs> okay. All right, that's junk data cards, nice. And I think that that is everything, honestly. All right, train stop is working. Um, all of this is ready. Now we just need to, last thing, hopefully this can go pretty quickly, is we need to set up the last bit of um, card production, right? So, whew, we have up to here. So we need to do this one first, which is biomechanical resistance data. Ooh, but we, then we need to do experimental biomass which I didn't account for. Uh, which is nutrient gel <laughs> and experimental biocultures. Gross. It's a little bit more biomass, not much. Yuck, this is awful. All right, well, I think actually given that, uh, we're gonna have a lot more work to do for the rest of this. We're like basically done with tier one and we're like, kind of halfway done with tier two. We've got almost everything set up for it. We literally just need to do now this experimental biomass, which is one growth facility for it, right? And yeah, I think, I think we'll be good, right? I think, yeah, I think we just need to do this at the beginning of next episode. I think, I think next episode for sure we can get through the rest of this. Like there's still a little bit to do, right? in terms of like handling fluids and like making sure that everything's kind of balanced, so on and so forth. But that's gonna be it for today's episode. Thank you guys for joining me on this biological adventure. We will very shortly be done with it. And I hope to see you guys all there. Have a good one.